Hey guys, Jailbroken iPod 69 here, and today I'm going to show you how to make um, your iPod, if you have it, updated to 5.1.1 from uh, tethered to untethered. Um, super easy. Uh, tethered, for those of you who don't know, is pretty much your iPod. You can't shut off um, without it getting unjailbroken. Uh, but untethered means you can, which is awesome because I play on mine a lot and it dies and then I'm worried about having to put the charger back in. Now I don't have to do that, so it's a relief. Um, you need to jailbreak your iPod or iDevice before you do this. Um, what you want to do is you want to go on Cydia. And once you're on Cydia, you want to go to search and type in Rocky Raccoon. I thought it was Raccoon when my friend told me, but no, it's Raccoon. Once you do that, something will pop up saying Rocky Raccoon 5.1.1 untethered. Uh, right here. I don't have the max sign or whatever that is. <coughs> What you want to do in the right hand corner is click install. Mine's already installed, so I can't uh, go through it slowly for you guys. Or yeah, read that if you really want to. And yeah, all you have to do is install it. It's pretty quick. Download. Um, once it's done downloading. Uh, you don't have to, but show off your iPod, turn it back on, make sure it's still jailbroken. If not, uh, well, I don't know, because it worked for me perfectly fine, and yeah. Um, I'm pretty sure that, here you go, this package will allow your 5.1.1 device to reboot without requiring an external tool such as Red Snow. There you go. Um, I drill broke mine with red snow. It's pretty easy. I like it. Um, I think you can do it no matter what drill broken tool you use. Um, yeah. Um, and so yeah, that's pretty much all you have to do. And my iPod's still drill broken. You already saw it's 5.1.1. And. Yeah, so subscribe, comment, like, and thank, guys. Bye.